So, this is a short tutorial on how to get Pixel Perfect camera working with Cinemachine. At the moment I have Cinemachine set up so that it just follows my character. And a little bit of smoothing for the camera follow. And you can see I've also bound the edges with a collider. Now it's best to be seen what the problem is from uh, running the game and building it. So I'm just going to build and run here. Let's give it a few seconds. And then we can see what the problem is with not having pixel perfect. There we go. So let's see what happens. If we move a little bit slow, you can see here on the house that all these pixels do not snap entirely. So it's like a shimmering effect. Maybe a bit of ghosting. Don't know how to explain it. You can see it on the character as well. Needs to settle a bit. Because it's not pixel perfect. Let's see how we can fix this. First of all, go to the main camera, add component and add a pixel perfect camera. Now you have to set your pixels per unit and a reference resolution. Well, I like this resolution because it's old school and widescreen. There's nothing else you have to do here. But the problem is that um, pixel perfect camera will try to adjust um, the orthographic size to get to achieve pixel perfect mode. But the problem is the camera is actually controlled by the virtual camera of Cinemachine. So they're trying to compete with each other. And it won't work. If we run this like this, you can see it's a bit better. don't seem to have any troubles here. Let's see if I can go to another... For some reason I still have perfect... Check. Yes. So at some point they're trying to... they're both trying to adjust the orthographic scale. So what you need to do in the virtual camera is um, add an extension and add Cinemachine Pixel Perfect. This is the script that communicates between the virtual cam, or actually the the Cinemachine brain, and the uh, Pixel Perfect camera. Now, what you need to set here is very important. In the virtual camera, uh, sorry, in the main camera, in the brain. The, the, the cinema brain instead of having the update method set to smart I think that's the the standard setting you need to set it to late and also the blend update mode needs to be set to fixed now we can check it again it's not very visible if you uh, do it in game mode just build it again and run just do a lot of testing Now pixel camera, pixel perfect camera will now adjust your orthographic size to match the pixel perfect mode. Now let's see. Now as you can see here, the house is really smooth, no ghosting whatsoever, no jittering in the character. Uh, when I first added it, it also uh, had problems with the confinement of pixel uh, of the cinema machine. But as you can see here, it's absolutely perfect no problem at all I can just move around and it confines the entire screen space to this as well and it's pixel perfect so it doesn't matter if I resize to anything nice that's how you set up cinema machine with pixel perfect camera 